Hey, what is up, guys? Renstags TV here. I miss you all, guys. Okay, and uh, for today's video, though, I'm just gonna share to you an update that was released by Vimos Pro or Vimos.com with their Vimos Pro option. And you know, I'll, I'll leave the rest to you guys to, to test it because they have claimed that they have fixed some bugs and all that. And uh, I'm just gonna show you though how to make sure that maps will work on it okay so pretty much everything else is just the same so vimos pro is what we are going to be downloading and install the uh, rom 7.1 64-bit to uh, test so how you could get it you, you can just open a uh, a browser of course and then go to vimos dot com just like that all right and then if you just click directly on the vimos pro download button it's not gonna respond so all you need to do is just to tap and hold it like this so you will get these other options as well so then you can click on download link and then just hit download then it will download the APK file so you know you can install it and then set it up for you so after that once you have that uh, Vimos Pro installed just open it and then you can choose the ROM 7.1 64-bit to install and then once you have it it also uh, let you install Google services but you have to access that via setting so the setting would be here, the VM setting, and this Google services option here. So make sure it's on, and then restart it. And after that, make sure also to go here under authority management, and under transducer, make sure this is turned on. Everything is turned on should uh, under it, unless the other ones are not supported, okay? So once that's already done, restart again the uh, Vimos Pro Virtual Machine. And by the way, to restart it, you will have this um, small button here on the side, which you can move around if you want to. But if you click on that, you can shut it down like this. And then hit this play button like to enter to your virtual machine. And then you can install maps and it should work fine. So I've already tested Android Auto, uh, this game, Pokemon Go. It doesn't work um, so far that I've tested. I just don't have enough time to really dig more into it, but probably I'll check more later on. But again, you know, this is something that you can try if you want to, but you know, if you already have the uh, V-Phone Gaga, I would suggest you stick to that because I think that works better um, based on my tests that I did previously so th that's pretty much it guys all the rest you can try to install and uh, check if it works for you and then see if you know if it's better for you to use on your device because again um, each of these virtual machines has or gives different results you know depending on what device you're using so that's the reason why I'm leaving up the rest to you guys to check and try all right so pretty much that's it for today's video guys so thank you very much all for your support and I'll be back soon um, I'm also still working on you know the uh, other solutions that we can do to install directly without the use of virtual machines um, I don't have any updates for that yet I, I know a lot of you guys are waiting for that unfortunately there's no luck yet but again I am um, I'm going to share okay uh, anytime soon if we have any good news about it I'll share it to my channel so make sure you're subscribed and hit that notification bell so you won't miss out any of the uh, new videos that I'll put up in here so thank you very much again you guys have a wonderful day peace Hello my friends, Rensdax TV here and if you like my video, please smash that like button, share the video, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for your help.
Here's how you do it. Boom. Bada bim bada boom. And if you are on your phone, here's how you do it. Boom. Bada bim bada boom. Thank you and see ya in my next videos. Peace.